Hello, V more Days. My name is Trey Trey. And today, guys, as you can see, what we are reviewing today is Transformers Buzzworthy Target Exclusive Pterosaur. Or should I say, we pay Pterosaur. So, anyway, guys, so, guys, I just found this from my local Target. And also, if you have seen my, my community post, I actually got this guy. Yeah, I showed him for me, which I got this guy. And uh, I would have done a view on him on like, that day, but I don't know the Transformer bed stuff. And, guys, I just have another Transformer toy for what's <coughs> So... So guys, if it was what was this for a VPR? So guys, the we the first pterosaur toy had the colors just like this. The head, the green on the chest, the purple uh, the purple paint. But the only difference is that this were these these was like this, like this whole part was black. This was black, this was black, this was black too. And of course he much small, like he was small as a rat trap. Like, it, the original was like this feet tall, like half of that toy. So, the guys, what we are doing today is something that, that you can do with the toy, like gimmicks out, like pieces you could just rip off. Don't worry, but then you don't worry, it'll go back in, it'll go back in, don't worry. And also, on the head, this kid. Okay, you can actually rip the head off. Okay. You can have to rip the head off, but I feel like it's gonna break or something. So, oh, you. There it is. You can wipe it off. Don't worry. Just gotta pull it right in there. Boop, no slip. Right back on. Put it back. So, if you guys want to do it today, is detail. So, detail. Detail. Wow. That, the, oh, I do actually like the figure color scheme. Like, I do actually like it. Looks pretty cool. I do actually like the, the green, but I kind of wish the wings had some bits of green or something. And if you look at, I like the, the head detail, has very good detail. The detail that I do have, the eyes are pretty accurate. I like the teeth flat. We both got, like, this big this big teeth and that big teeth. I like the teeth for Ken's accent, if you can look very close at the tail. Good. Right here, it also feels like there's all just spikes on its tongue. And if you look up here, it's gonna like hollow up here at the very top of its head. So that's pretty cool. But let's look at his real face. So his real face, he got great face. He always got that smirk, which I really like. And I like the helmet too. And I like the kind of mohawk he always had. I like like this little thing on his bottom of his chin. It'll tell me what to get. I've helped transformation a little bit. So then, you guys, I like. It. I'm gonna take the details off. Give it just a. A out of 10. A out of 10. A out of 10 because um, the wings and stuff. Is it not directly accurate? But it's pretty accurate. So now, enough with details. Let's get that, get that out of here. Time for articulation. So, articulation you can do is it's like you do. Take go 28 degrees. Okay. This I can actually turn on way, but it's because of like some bits right here, you can't do that. This I can do, the, what the, the, that way I can turn around and do this little joint right here. The hands out of here. The hands can also do some different things for me. Shit, I can do that. The hands can like do like a lap pose, like what is actually the pose that looks like. The hands can fold, the feet can turn around, so you can do like this. It is also a transformation. Yeah, it's a lot of stuff. Yeah, so guys, all the collection is also of the wings. The wings can fold. It looks kind of like kind of cool a little bit. Fuck it up. Wings can open and close. The wings like spread out like this, like that. And the tail also can, can also move up, up like that. And for some reason, it got two tails. I don't have no idea why. And the arms can turn around. He does the same thing. The legs can like do a lot of things, which I will show you on transformation. Like this can open up some very real reason. I don't know why. So anyway, guys, this is the office collection now. Oh, accessories. So this doesn't come from any accessories, but when you get this figure, there's gonna be like a little packet, like on the side, that's gonna have his weapon, which is the paint as well, so color accurate, and 
these little pieces. So these are very extremely little. So guys, uh, do not lose these popcorn bits as a girl these. So when you do, I almost saw these. You can either do like on here, but you got chicken right here. But you cannot have them like backwards or something. If it does, like, oh wait, it's supposed to go no, it's supposed to go backwards, but it looks cool to have like forwards. Wait a second, I thought. Okay, okay maybe you ch Okay, okay, I'm never gonna go like anywhere or something. They weren't able to do that before for some reason. I have no idea. Yes. So I did, I'm not supposed to go this way or where you are. Well, yeah, like that. But the gun, it can go. Oh, this noise of detail. If you look at that, we look and see. I forgot to stick it there. Focus. Focus, camera. You can see a little white dot. That's it. I forgot to stick it there. Well, I wonder if y'all just know I can't really see from my own way, but you can see it pretty good. Well, I can see it pretty good. You can just see a little white dot. But for the gun, you do like this. I always like it. I also have like that kind of like shotgun ish a gun. And I think this gun is supposed to like. Okay, like go on like the wing, do a transformation or something. Yeah, the gun can go just like that. But robot mode looks pretty ugly. Yeah, it does look pretty ugly. <coughs> also, something I um is using from another figure that I got. You can do with the score just going. I think you have to fit this. Yep, it looks like he's shooting a. Oh, baby, I'm the camera! Okay, let's get out of here. Now, we do the accessories. Detail. It's a glitch. And then we'll be everyone be waiting for transformation. So now, I will suggest taking off all these. Cut obviously. But I'm going to tell you, you may giggle. Giggles end now. Eh, 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 eh. So first of all guys, what you guys are gonna do is I just make it a wings and pretty straight and stuff. And what you do, this is how you do it, the structure is just a lot of doing. So I suggest you open up the back and we'll just put it head drip like that's how you do. You got to see these little like black hinges. If you got this pull it up, you that little click. See how you go up. Yeah, so guys, we're not getting worried. It's not going to break. You just got to keep it up like this. I mean, it's going to be that makes them actually makes them look taller. So what you do is you actually you push his head in there. And I like this little jet mark. That's how you like pull the head back up. But you push it like that. You plug it. You bring this head forward and turn it around. Now you double search this version. Let's see if I have a tarsal like this, which I hate, but you don't. But what you do now is you get to pop off the tail real quick so you can turn this around and pop it right back there. Then you turn the fear around. You spin them. This also talk about the electric or articulation to transformation. Like that. You turn the you turn the legs around, do it like that. Do it looks like that. And yeah, there's a guy do a lot of bending. Maybe doing a yoga class here, sorry. Because it's gonna hurt. Now, you turn these legs around. It will. You go back to the arms. If you guys see these little, like, holes right there. See it right there? You do this with the hand. You do this. You push it upward. And. You put the leg right here or something. Same thing with the other arms. You, you do the exact same process. <coughs> with the same process, but I don't want to do the front slide. It's like that. Now you come back to the legs. Now, what do you do with it? I do it like that. I don't know how to do it like directly, so I don't like to do it like this. And do it like this. It's just supposed to be like some hinges or something, but I don't want like crazy big pieces. So, yeah. Let me see what you got. I mean, no, no, no. Just out of the bowl, it's pretty accurate. I mean, it's like, ow, ow, that's how it looks in the air. So, if you like doing like this, that's just a pretty good. Too bad here, make them like see it up, like how we are looking at some of the show, like what, like, see it This is all I could get from, but it's actually not that bad. Mine's a real bad. Yes, yes. 
Let's look at that face. This face looks good. I already don't know what this was for. It's just always here for detail. Obviously, because we already got our tail back here. But, the beast mode pretty good. I mean, it looks pretty good. Pretty easy to do. I mean, you can figure half of it out if you don't do the steps. But you guys got to read it with the legs and arms. But for the top, pretty easy. Now, time for Tyra Saw. Tyra Rice! Okay, guys, now that Tyra Saw is back in robot mode, time for. Okay, now it's time for Seth's comparison. So, we're going to compare them with every prayer card in the live Well, almost all the prayer cards were not a tarantula side of him. If I saw him, I'll be dying. I'll be, I'll be dead. I'll be, I will probably will be dead. For like Rackia, as I said, she, she got very injured and died in battle. So we got other bot who's also in the thumbnail with us. Love the nature. So we got old Buzz Bug guys here. Plus we can bed. Pterosaur. Fix you up a little bit. Okay, now uh, let's go. Let's go far with the wings. Bosmer seems to be pretty high up to him. I mean, his legs are basically so close. He's just a little bit bigger. So now, time for the probably the smallest prayer card in the kingdom. Like, he's like the smallest prayer card in the kingdom line. Scorponok. Scorponok. Yeah, he's pretty small. I mean, his legs are pretty smaller. Oh, the reason he's bigger is because of his body right here. A time for the second biggest pet car, well, almost biggest, well, at least until Inferno comes in, in which I will be so happy with him if he comes in, because hopefully all my other star scream is on Amazon and Amazon pre order. So when Inferno is coming in, I'm, a, I'm definitely going to buy him for Christmas. So, guys, they're going to get a bunch of toys for Christmas, but I may do a Christmas special or live or something. So, now, look, Terrasaur, that about obviously towers. Pterosaur. Yeah, so it's just like his head is like right there. It's time for his unworthy leader that he somewhere serves. Because he always betrays him. I mean, is it weird? Like, in the last episode, he was being treacherous with drug designs. Next to Tron Cops get mad at him, but he never does any treasures again. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, I don't know what happens in the, in the dark side after that, but. I don't think I I think I, I think I taught children a very good lesson because he betrays them like 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 he betrayed them in the sixth episode, then eighth, then thirteenth. Like my man, and he attempted he again in like the fourth episode. Like my man betrays them like so much times. Megatron, the big hookah. Yeah, he's pretty big. Yeah, pretty big. So I make a drawing. The one in here. Oh, I see what's the problem. He's mad because he wants some more bigger bots. Don't worry, make a drawing. It's fun. will be coming soon. So anyway, guys, that's it for this icy person. Anyway, guys, that's it for this video. Then time for the rank of the toy at all. Nine out of ten. I mean, this toy is fine, perfecto. I mean, there's no problem with it. Like, it's not my mommy, guys. It is. Kind of the color scheme or like wings or something like that. But of the nose, you know, really big bits, it's fine, but I can't give it a hundred percent perfecto score. Sorry, sorry, score. But anyway, guys, bye.